Hello, everyone. Today, I'll walk you through how that we can add resources to Claude Desktop to processes and resolve incidents and tasks quickly. First, here's how resources are added. As you can see, multiple resources are available. Let me choose incident list and task list form the resources list. The agent has identified a critical incident. A user is unable to launch their VPN since the last software update. The software update itself is not working. There are no tasks in priority one at the moment. All active tasks are categorized under different priority levels. The most urgent active one identified is related to changing the default router. Now the agent is asking, would you like additional details about these incidents and tasks? Do you need help in creating a resolution plan? Let me ask it to create a plan to address the issues. Proceeding with the next step, the agent is now working on creating a resolution plan. As you can see, Claude is asking me to accept the usage of updating incidents tool, as it is going to use update incident MCP tool to update the work notes of the incidents with the resolution plan. Here comes the details of its actions. The VPN problem is due to a compatibility issue with a recent update. Resolution plan, a step-by-step -step fix has been outlined and the status remains in progress. New tracking incident created, assigned to David Liu. This concludes our demo. Thank you. Now, let's move on to the next demo. Now, I'm selecting a list of resources. As you can see, there are multiple options available. Let's go with incidents. Immediately, Claude gathers all relevant incident information and adds it here. Now, I wanna create a visualization based on intent and all this data. Let's see what Claude does. First, it analyzes the incident data and filters out only those created in 2025. Great. That's exactly what I requested. Next, it determines the intent of the request, arguably the most crucial part. This involves machine learning and sentiment analysis. Oh, look at this. Claude is using React to generate a visualization. It has identified some incidents, along with their descriptions and other details. But... I don't see the intent explicitly yet. No worries. Let's give it a moment. Since there are no incidents updated in 2025, Claude adjusts on the fly. Instead, it's creating a visualization focused on incident priorities and categories to help identify patterns. And this is exactly what we wanted, a way to uncover patterns based on intent or categories. It is developing a script in React.js to create visualization for that data. Amazing. Okay, here's the analysis. A by category, there are four incidents related to inquiry slash help requests. Uh, it's currently using default system categories instead of deriving new ones from sentiment analysis. Key insights. The most common category is inquiry. Hardware-related incidents are less frequent, but still notable. Now let's check priority distribution. Yes. The data confirms that critical issues make up a significant portion of the tickets. One more thing, Claude is now displaying a category priority mix, highlighting that the most critical category has three flagged incidents. I simply provided the incidents, and Claude not only analyzed everything, but structured it beautifully into meaningful insights. That's amazing. Thank you.